I know these are gonna IKEA bag with me. I gotta go. I gotta go. So hey my lovelies, welcome back to another video. It's your girl, I'm a lovely here, and I'm back with another one. And if you're new here, I welcome you with lots of love. And in today's video, we are going to be getting ready for a beach day. I'm getting ready for the beach. So this is the look I came up with. I hope you guys like what you see. We are all glowed up. We're in the bikini, okay? Don't mind my triple D's, yes. Yes, your girl got that triple day, okay? And yeah, so if you guys want to see how I achieve this beautiful look right here. Keep on this I don't know how hot it gets eh I should put on I don't know if it's a crisp hold on let me see okay so 30 is the highest so I think 10 is 10 is fine yeah 30 is the highest so I think 10 is fine and then oh I don't have my shirt to burn me and then I'm also gonna be using my hot comb just to really make this hair flat I got this from Amazon and I got this flat iron from Walmart. Now I haven't really taken my time to ever straighten my hair in a minute. And I'm going to be using this Got To Be Garden Angel Gloss Finish Flat Iron Spray. That's how that looks. I'm gonna go in and prime the face. And what I'm going to be using is my Milk Hydro Grip Primer, my Becca Poreless Primer, you guys know that. And I'm also gonna go in with my Smashbox Photo Finish. And then I'm gonna moisturize my face with my First Aid Ultra Repair. I didn't sleep last night, so that's how I was just laying in the bed, but I should have woke up. So now I know, like, girl, you cannot do that, especially when you're trying to film a video. Like, you just gotta go and do what you need to do. So I'm gonna go in with this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel Sunscreen. It has SPF 50 in it, which is good. Um, This is my first time using this bad boy, so hopefully it goes well. Hopefully it doesn't bother my skin. I kind of grabbed way too much, but I'm gonna put this all over my neck. First, it has a small. I hate things that have a small because it really starts to bother me. But I'm gonna just put that all over my face. Oh, but it feels very smooth on the skin, though. Ooh, it just gave me more of a radiant. This smells good. Hopefully it doesn't irritate my skin. If it doesn't and it's perfect for like sensitive skin, you guys, I would definitely recommend it. But let's see how it goes. So now I'm gonna go in with my Born This Way Multi Sculpting Concealer. So now I'm gonna go in with my Sephora Shimmer Eyeshadow in Satin Corset. I'm gonna put this for my brow bone highlight. I really love this. If you've been on my channel for a very long time, you guys know that I've been using this for a very long time. 
Do you guys see that sheen? That shine here. I actually want to go in with Makeup by Orlando's um, Jam Rock palette with this point, but. I'm going to be wearing huge lashes today. Show you guys the thickness of them. These are my lashes, so. Yeah, coming soon, coming soon, coming soon. Yeah, these lashes are looking real good. I tried to wear my small mink one, but it's just on look me. So I'll definitely show you how my small mink lashes look on my clients and things like that, but it is not look at me. <laughs> I think I have big eyes. And this sun to me didn't react to my face. So that's even a plus right there, okay? I'll be going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills luminous foundation in the number 55w this is my first time using this foundation so wish me luck i don't know how it's gonna go hopefully it comes through for your baby girl very nice texture to the skin very nice texture to the skin wow Wow, I look good. I look real good. Wow, you guys see the luminous feel it gets to me, to my skin, and the application is beautiful. It's a very lightweight feel. The coverage, ooh, the coverage is nice. I think it's like medium coverage. Yeah, I think it's me because we can kind of see my uneven, my uneven skin tone. No, but this is really nice. Okay, I'm so excited. Okay, so now I'm going to go back in with my Boy This Way Concealer in Chai. I like applying a lot of concealer. Ain't nobody stopping me with that, period. I don't care. I love concealer. That is like my baby. I'm going to be using this beautiful e.l.f. beauty blender that I purchased from Walmart. If you guys, this is my second purchase of this. If you guys don't have it, please go and purchase. It just blends out so beautiful. Super, I don't want it super wet today. It blends out so beautiful. You guys need to look at I think I'm just going to quickly add my contour and use this to dry bit. I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Cream Contour Palette. It has this dark shade that I liked that um, I liked before. There's that dark shade right there. What do you guys think? Should I get a lighter concealer? I should add a little bit of some light concealer underneath my eyes. Okay, and this one's a lot better. This is a butterscotch. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah. This makes my eyes look nicer and brighter. Yeah, I like that. I really do. I'm just like, yeah, I like that, I like that. I think bringing it to the nose just made that look so much better. And then I'm gonna use a small baby beauty blender and get the nose right. That's pretty, that's pretty. <laughs> oh, my makeup is coming up so flawless. So with my nose contour, mahogany, Mahogany is really dark, so you have to be really gentle with this one. I'm gonna just leave it right there so that we can spread this on our own. 
I like using a small brush for this. I have a different small brush. I'm just use. I'm gonna just use this little small brush to blend out nicely. I'm gonna go in with my Sasha Buttercup. You guys know this is my baby. Forever will be. Oh. Yikes, that is a lot that came out. Okay, we're screwed. We are definitely screwed, okay. Let me apply that a bit more. <laughs> Let me just apply. I'm setting everywhere that I added all that concealer. I'm gonna get rid of the powder now. I'm using my Sephora brush. It's an airbrush. If you guys are oldie, you guys been rocking with me for a while, you guys know what I'm using. So, it does give you this airbrush feeling and an airbrush look. You see that? So, it's bomb. So, four brushes are so bomb and they're good quality. So, I started to invest in them more, especially when they're on sale. When they're on sale, you guys go rush and get because. Trust me, you're saving coins and bucks. <laughs> you are saving coins and bucks. This is so pretty. This is real pretty. This is what I actually wanted. You see how my... Mm. Yeah, this is actually what I wanted. This is actually what I wanted. So now for bronzer. We're going to go in with the Fenty Beauty Bronzer and Mocha Mommy. It's so hard to open, but this is how it looks. It has this nice, rich, burgundy look to it. And it's a very rich color, so when you're bronzing, it will definitely show. I know you guys see me going back and forth because I just keep going back and forth just to make sure I get the exact bronzy look that I want. So everything you do when you add your liquid things and clean things, just set it with the powder as well so that everything can legit sit and not move. Okay, so now I'm gonna go add the blush and I'm gonna go in my Juvia's Place Saharan Blush Volume 1 palette. Perfect for deeper skin tones. It has all these rich colors in it. And I don't know which I'm gonna go in with, but I think I'm gonna go in with this one just because it has like a red tint to it. And probably add a pinch of the orange one as well. So everything's coming out together. Everything's coming together. I'm super excited. So let me just quickly add this. Oh, you guys, I am almost done. Ooh, that was too much, that was too much, bitch. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna go in with my Sephora powder in deep. It's the micro smooth powder, which I heard a lot of good things about this. And I'm gonna go over everything, like I'm gonna go over everything to make sure that everything just comes out super nicely blended and nothing looks harsh too harsh or too crazy oh my god you guys this powder also has a nice like i don't know i think it has like a more like smooth velvety finish or vel velvety feel like something is going on feel on it yeah yo and real smooth I definitely will recommend this powder just because it feels very nice to its face. Do you guys see this coverage right now? Yeah. Yeah. This is a vibe. This is a vibe, my lovelies. Y'all gonna love me today. You guys are definitely gonna love me today for this video. I could have done, you know, a little better, but time was not on my hands today. I'm gonna add bottle wash instead of this. I think so. Bomb lashes is life. 
you don't think so, then get out my face. I'm going go back in with the Sephora powder and kind of like dust it off with it. Mm -hmm. We are almost done. My lips are so dry, so I'm gonna go in. Guys, no! But my Laneige Lip Seeping Mask, super raw. Wow, you guys, my best friend is here. Oh, shit. No, come, sit down. It's a, it's a tutorial. I got like really huge lips, you guys. So um, I took over my lips just to get a nice smooth finish. And just to make it really nice and juicy. You see that? Uh, and right now I'm using the Morphe Richie on top of chestnut. Just to like darken it just a little bit. I'm gonna add um NYX butter gloss in Madeline. This is the bar. What did I tell you guys? It's like a lip gloss somewhere. It's definitely Ooh, that's pretty. I think this is for ooh, that is pretty. Okay, so that's pretty. So this is what I'm gonna be taking with me. Um I didn't spray my face, I just took it in but I did not spray my face. So I'm going to be going in with the Morphe Container Setting Mist. This is from the Saviti collection. If you guys don't know, now you know and go and purchase. I got this cute foldable fan from the Dollarama, you guys. <laughs> it's so fetch. That is so cute. It's like a paper book. It's just so cute. And it's just $1.25, I think. And it comes in a lot. I think I have to go get more. It's very convenient. Okay, we are almost done with this look. Um, now I'm gonna go in with my Wet n Wild Mega Highlighting Powder in Precious Petals. I haven't, can you guys see it? Hope you guys can. I haven't used this in so freaking long, but I love the application to its highlighter. It's super soft, but super pretty. So, ooh, but this look doesn't need highlights. So I'm about to highlight my nose. Yeah, that's so pretty, see that? I'm gonna just lightly, just lightly. Yeah, that's pretty. Cause you don't wanna look too much at the beach, but you still wanna look like you're glowing in a way. But not like glowing too much, but glowing like sun kissed, you know? Let's try to take this off. Let's try to take this off. Oh, hell. Yo, this hair is a mess. That's what I'm definitely gonna say today, that this hair is a mess. To be
I'm just so annoyed. I'm here right now. That's just the only thing. I did not think I was coming to um be late. Okay. This is looking real good. Okay. Oh, you got I am running hella late. Everyone's gonna kill you. For sure, for sure. <gasps> but I never relate, so they gotta allow me. What do you guys think so far though? Before I leave. It's our oh wait, hold up. Er, er, skirt skirt. Let me add some powder quick to the lace, because all you guys can see that like whole whiteness. I want it to get scalp, not whiteness. Okay. Yes, baby. So I'll be right back. Let me just go get dressed. Pack them real quick and I'll be right back. So right now I'm gonna add my lady stick invisible. I'm just gonna put that all over my armpit. Try to throw this in my leg. I think I have something there. And then I'm also gonna go in with my Neutrogena Ultra Sheer Body Mist Sunscreen. It has SPS um, 60 in it. Um, it was on sale from at Walmart for like 13 bucks. So right now I'm gonna just, I want you guys to see what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kind of mist this all over my body. So I'm gonna use my MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plug Gold Light. I don't know if they still have this one. I don't know if it's discontinued or not, but I wanna go in this and I'm gonna spray this all over the body. Just to give me that, ooh, did you guys see that effect? Yeah, I want that glow. So you guys, this is the end of the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'm about to go, I'm about to be off to the beach. I hope you guys like this whole beach. This whole beach, get ready with me. Yeah, your girl looks like a goddess, okay? And the beach I'm going to is, um, what is it, Scarborough, Scarborough Bluffs. So that's where we're going today to link up, drink up, whatever. I think I packed up everything. I'm gonna be vlogging as well, so hopefully this goes well. I'll be bringing this orange fan since I'm all orange to out, you know. You know, I'm gonna take some nice pictures and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys, I love you all. Mwah.